Hungry Monkey never refuses an invitation to eat tacos and burritos, even if he didn't know what they are. The tacos have meat. The burritos are vegetable and cheese wrapped in a tortilla. Buen provecho. That's my mom, Maritza, and you know my dad, Luis, and my uncle, Felix, and my sister, Cecilia. Marco tells me you're feeling sad about the bandstand, George. We are sad, too. Yeah. We tried playing in the street this morning, but it was too noisy. It's worse than the subway. It was nice to have a place where people could actually hear our music. Hmm. Eating great food, talking about music, it reminded George of the last time he'd been at Pischetti's. <laughs> Do you have a place in mind, George, where people can hear us? <laughs> Isn't it great? Everyone has come to hear the band. <laughs> Pischetti's might be fine for a man with a violin who could go up to each table to be heard, but it wasn't working for a whole entire band. George and Marco decided to find a place that wasn't crowded or noisy. You live here? Oh, la perro. George really hoped the lobby would work. That way, he could hear the band all the time. So you think if we sound good in here, then the whole band will sound good? <laughs> to George's surprise, they didn't sound good. They sounded sort of muffled. Except to Hundley. George thought they'd sound less muffled at the zoo. There weren't any curtains or carpets. But the lions were a little loud. There were no lions or carpets at the railway station, and the room was big enough for a band. Too big. The high ceiling made it difficult to hear the music. The bridge reminded George of the bandstand a little too echoey. Okay, so we need a room big enough for the band, but not too big, a high ceiling, but not too high, and no lions or carpets or waiters. Hi, George. And hello, friend of George's. Hola. Are you coming to the opening tonight? Marvels of the Maya. <laughs> it's our biggest archaeological exhibit ever. There'll be food and lots of people. Bring your friends. Lots of people? Was Marco thinking what George was thinking? <laughs> Wait! <laughs> yes? Um, do you think you might want some music tonight? My family has a band. Music? Oh, fantastic idea. Seven o'clock. See you then. <laughs> ah!